this particular phrase is one that is more the deep cuts of Christianese, okay, of stuff Christians say. We're very acquainted with the word saved and born again. We may have heard these routinely, but this is more of a, of a deeper one that, that people say sometimes that, um, that might get lost in translation to those uh, outside a uh, Christian um, evangelical bubble that we sometimes live in. It's called dying to self. What does it mean when I die to myself? Okay, that sounds really heady and, and huge, and, and it is. But basically, when, it, when I say I, I need to die to myself in order to serve Christ, it means basically that I need to put my wants, my desires, my uh, priorities, okay, as secondary to the will of Christ in my life. I might have a desire to do this thing that may be good. It may be honoring and it may be ethical and there may not be a hint of, of negativity in that, but it's, it's not the best thing that Christ would want for me at this time in my life. And it takes a great deal of discipline to say, I, I reject this because I know this isn't the best for me. This isn't what God wants for me. So I die to myself I essentially say, this is not what I'm going to do. I'm going to let Christ basically live through me. This works really well when we're in a tight spot. When that person cuts you off in traffic, or the cashier is rude to you, or your customer is rude to you, or uh, your boss is cruel to you, or says something really maniacal to you, and you want to naturally strike back. And they may, in fact, deserve everything you have to say. But in the process, you might lose your witness. In the process, you might say something that, while true, may be difficult for you to be taken seriously as a believer in the workplace or at home or with your kids or, or wherever okay, you find yourself. The phrase dying to self means even though they may deserve this and I may be, may be absolutely right in doing this behavior, I need to not do this because it may damage my witness uh, to Christ with the people that I would say this to or do this to. So it's making yourself secondary in order to uh, have Jesus um, live through you, so to speak, and to uh, have your witness intact, okay, in the community and with those you, you work with, okay? So I want to encourage you, be in a practice of dying to yourself, and it's not just a one-time thing, Sometimes it's a situation by situation, moment by moment, hour by hour thing that we have to put our rights aside so that Jesus is lifted up in our hearts and in our lives for his glory. Okay, so that's a phrase that Christians say, and this has been Stuff Christians Say. We'll see you in the next video.